Well, one of the things that we know is that there are various different options available to us to try to address the issue of youth suicide. Some of those options are through schools. It's a sobering second thought for me to present what works and what doesn't work. The other thing that we're going to be talking about is what can schools actually do after a young person has died by suicide? What should the school response be? What should the school, school response not be? Those are some of the things we're going to be addressing. Although we use the word school mental health, what we really mean is everybody that is working together to improve the lives of young people and their families, to improve the mental health needs of young people, and to improve mental health care for young people. We need to reach out to where young people are. That's why we have to reach out to schools. But it's not limited to schools. It's everybody who works to improve the lives of young people. That's what we're here for. Suicide is a very, very complicated issue. Education about suicide does not prevent suicide. What we are going to discuss as part of what we're doing in this School Mental Health Academy is really talk critically about what things we know can actually help prevent youth suicide and what things we know don't help prevent youth suicide.